I'm sure uh, most of you here love CSS, like I do. But I'm also sure one day you've been frustrated uh, because you don't have variables, you don't have math, uh, you can customize color and stuff because it's not a programming language and we are still looking sometimes for some uh, you know, similar feature that you found in this kind of language. So uh, we use Preposor to stop being frustrated and with uh, Preposor, we have some new at include uh, at extend and this kind of stuff. But our websites is, get, is getting bigger and bigger. And the code base is more complex. And we are starting to have a new problem, which uh, is not about the language itself, but it's about the organization. Uh, so, what should we do? There is a lot of people right now that have worked on, uh, you know, making new stuff, new methodology. And for my concern, I was happy with BAM, which helped me a lot to, you know, kind of deprecate for me this kind of feature because I found this is not CSS and it can make some crappy code. Meanwhile, the W3C have uh, worked on a lot of stuff, like custom properties. Uh, we have variable right now, usable in Firefox, and we can make some math too. We'll have some custom media queries soon in Internet Explorer, uh, the next version. I heard that on Twitter yesterday. And we will have a lot of color manipulation possible with uh, mainly the new function color, which allow uh, you to modify and use a lot of modifier like lightness, alpha, tint, saturation, whiteness, blackness, and there is too much for my brain, so I can tell you everything. Um, there is more. There is always be more uh, selector, like match, as, etc. There is new function, like uh, function for colors. And you will have soon nesting av available. Uh, so maybe we can say that we can uh, go back to CSS because uh, it will be doable. And that's why I've worked on a project called CSS Next, uh, half of uh, 1.0 version is available, 0 0.5 since this morning. And um, CSS Next is just a spec. You can use with some limitation, for now only one, uh, that don't frustrate me. You can use a CSS spec right now. You can check the website. Uh, it's in order, at least take a look. Uh, try, you will find some links about the spec. And there is a lot of plugin, Grant, Gulp, Branch, Blockly, Duo.js, and uh, it's even in Prepros 5 already for people who use that. So give it a try, thanks.